Welcome to Arise Fashion Week 2019. It is that one period when everybody who is anybody in fashion shows who they are, what they are, and what they are made of. There's gonna be a lot of models walking the runway and a lot of designers showing what they have put together over the period of time to showcase the beautiful pieces that they have dreamt of or somehow created to make and wow the guests who are here to see them. Now, I am one of those people who is exceptionally excited when it comes to fashion. I'm looking forward to the likes of Maya Tafo, Clan, and a host of others. Well, the aim of our Ice Fashion Week this year has always been the same, to introduce um, the Nigerian designers to the global market and give them a wider by the outreach. Arise Fashion Week basically puts Nigeria and Africa as a whole in the forefront in the international community and I feel like we don't have enough of that so whenever I see that support happening well, I'm, 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 always, I'm always happy to support. What is it about Fashion Week especially for Arise that makes you all hype and pumped? The fact that there's so many fabulous fashionistas in one room because we're so electric we're so fun and then the fact that we get to have a whole week dedicated to us is nice. I think Africa is the future and I want to be a part of this future. So that's what makes me come here. I'm wearing a Margiela shoes and then I'm wearing my pants and this is actually made from Moroccan blanket and it's all handmade in Morocco. Of course I'm wearing a Gucci belt and a very simple uh, white shirt. Yeah. Now, why did you decide to put a bandana on? No, I think it's cool. Good. Yeah, it's like it. rocket. I got it from a thrift store. You know, I, yes. I, I, I like this is from a thrift store. This is from a thrift store on Instagram. Yeah, I'm all oh. thrift up tonight. All you people who are trying to make thrift look so bad. Look at that. Well, basically, it's it's two things. It's about the construction of the suit, which is um, a little bit asymmetrical, and then also about color blocking. It's a mustard navy blue. So all the other things you see are just accessories to go with it. <laughs> What, what was the uh, inspiration behind the show you just put together? Um, I want the world to know that uh, fine lingerie can also be produced from Africa. I know that, I believe, I'm confident and sure that I'm the first and only black person doing this level of lingerie that I do. I use the same exact material that the biggest brands in the world use. My designing actually are one of a kind pieces and it's there quite a while and it's all about culture and uh, recycling and about many, many things that are uh, important for, for the future for all of us. We showcased Mimi for the first time, which is like the diffusion range and very inspired by the urban beats of Lagos. So you have a lot of Lagos vibe going on, but we had to um, put in the other cities, which was like Milan and everything, so it has a city vibe. Thank you so much for hanging out with me on the very first day of Arise Fashion Week 2019 right here at the Lagos Continental Hotel in Victoria Island, Nigeria. Now a lot of designers did show up and they showed out and they did show us that they putting a lot of work for this particular night to become a success.